Oh, dum da da dee, I'm working with the soil, getting all the gardens ready for the spring. Oh, oh, hello, uh, hello, hey there, didn't see you there. This is Terry with more tips on working from home. Um, no, no, I, I wasn't doing anything in the garden. I remember that proposal that I had due at five. Uh, this, uh, you know, the big uh, bucket right here, that's just for uh, putting my thoughts in. And, uh, this, uh, oh, the garden spade over there? Uh, never mind that. Definitely don't need that to be doing my work. Anyway, that brings us to today's topic, which is communicating with your co-workers when working from home so that people know everyone is working and pulling their weight. Now, if you're a manager, the situation we're in here is one of trust. You have to have a certain amount of faith in your team that they are doing their work. However, at the same time, it creates a new responsibility for the worker. As a worker, you have to practice what's called signaling. What's signaling, you ask? Well, signaling is whatever you do during the day to let your coworkers know that you're working. You have to develop routines around it and make sure everyone understands your signals. It could just be chit-chat in the day about the project you're working on. It could be anything that shows engagement with the work that's currently at hand. It could be status reports, or you could develop some new daily rituals around it. At any rate, once you have good signaling in place, no one will have to worry about whether a dinosaur is sloughing off in the garden or working on his proposal that's due at five that he definitely didn't forget about. Right. See you later. Gotta get back to work.